Why, hello, doll. Come here often? <coughs> what did you say? <coughs> Why, hello, doll. Come here often? Is that supposed to be funny? I... but... First, you drag me off, and then you try to be cute? Why hasn't it occurred to you that I might be well and truly pissed off? <laughs> well, why? Hello, doll. Come here often. Whoa! No brawling in my bar. This may be the favorite hangout of the lowest scum in town, but some rules still apply, you know. He started it. I haven't done a thing. Yeah, he's got a point. Running around like an idiot ain't a crime. Hey! But maybe being an idiot is. I said, hey! You're lucky I don't hit women. Go ahead and try. Maybe I'll start by giving you a good spanking. If you fancy a broken jaw, be my guest. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here in the floating black market, we settle our differences in a civilized manner. There is only one way to get you two to quit your bickering. Platypus Pataka. <laughs> Bring it on! Fun. Maybe you're not the little idiot I took you for after all. That's because people tend to overlook my true greatness. So, what shall we get ourselves into next? Oh, well, since you seem to be at one with yourself once again, I suppose we could go ahead with the surgery. 
Hmm. I regret that in a way. I feel oddly liberated without my snooty and my gullible traits. Ah, I could get used to the thought of dating three goals. Rufus! What? It's just that I like every aspect of you, baby. Yeah, I bet. We had better get started. This is getting crazier by the minute. I'm going to take the cartridges to Doc's lab now. Meet me there, all right? She's into me! What's going on here? Janosch? Shh! I must listen and find out what is going on in there. Why? What is it that's going on in there? I mean, and what are you doing here anyway? We are putting your concept into practice. What do you think? My concept? Yes, you were completely right, of course. You cannot start a revolution by just shitting around doing nothing. Therefore, we are going to actively snatch the cartridges. Whoa, wait a minute. Those cartridges contain the mind of my girlfriend. Girlfriend? In your dreams, first off, go list a functionary of the resistance. So, of course she's going to sacrifice herself for the good cause. Sacrifice? Are you totally out of your mind? Unfortunately, another organization has become aware of the Extensions Codex, or could I say, an organization. What? Do you mean Donna? Precisely. The unorganized crime has held up in Doc's lab. They took Doc and Girl hostage and are trying to extort free passage. But the revolution doesn't take kindly to extortion. As soon as the clock strikes the full hour, we will system the premises. Actually, Girl left us disturbing. Liebold and I will hold this position. What? But that's completely insane. Um, so it is. I know these people. They'll stop at nothing. You're just gonna get yourselves killed. Or me, as it is. Judge is the fate of a freedom fighter. Always ready to die for the good cause. Please, don't act just yet. Maybe I can think of something. Wenzel always used to dress up as arsonist Cujo Cunning. Even he looked more dangerous than Janosch and his bunch. Although his cloak did burn really well. Hello, Leibold. Hey, Rufus. How's the siege going? Could be better. Not much, uh, going on, huh? There is that. And we're out of peanut flips. Wenzel always used to dress up as arsonist Cujo Cunning. Even he looked more dangerous than Janosch and his bunch. Although his cloak did burn really well. Hello, Garliff. Hey, Rufus. Death to the Organon! The Organon? Well, I thought you were fighting here against unorganized crime. You, um, have to see it in context. There is a connection. You just have to follow the leads and toy the ends together. Uh, speaking of which, your shoelaces are on time. I know. I just can't get the loops right. <sighs> no more questions. And? What about it? I thought you were going to try something. If you don't come up with something right now, we'll have to storm Doc's office. No, uh, no, no, no. Uh, whatever you do, don't storm in. I'll think of something, really. All right, then. What are you waiting for? To show us what you have got besides the mastery of shibboleth in your speech? What will you do? What else? I'm going in there now. But the place is crawling with unorganized criminals. I can handle them. Hey, open up. It's me, Rufus. Yes? Uh, Yoo-hoo, can I come in for a moment? That won't work. You can use the portal soon. But first, you have to do something for me. Here. What's this? Another remote? Yes, it's Leibold's. It seems to be an older model. But, hey, I know how to use a remote. Yeah, of course you do. Liebold is the fat one, right? I'm only asking because I haven't seen an implant. You can do it. When you're finished, you can use the portal. Then I'll explain everything. Huh? What portal? Trust me, and not a word to Janosch. What was that?
Hello, Leibold. Hey, Rufus. Is there a reason you're staring at me like that? Ah, uh, no, no. Huh, I wonder what all these buttons do. Ah, I'll just push the biggest one. And zap! Oh, look at me. I completed an important mission. Yeah, any monkey could have done that. This sucks. What the 